adult brain is divided into three parts the cerebrum, cerebellum, and <laughs> cerebellum and brain stem. So, balik ka sa dorsal surface. So, there you find your medial longitudinal fissure. Which contains the pulp cerebri. There are two major groups seen on the lateral surface. The lateral sylvian fissure and the central sulcus of Rolando. Ah, okay. Now to the ventral surface of the brain. The diencephalon is covered but for the most part by the cerebral hemisphere. The following structures are seen. First is your optic chiasma. <laughs> <laughs> which is a transversely oriented fiber. Then, anteriorly to it, you have your optic nerve. Optic nerve. Then posterior to the optic chiasma is your optic tract. Okay. Then you have the mammillary body, which are small rounded elevations. <laughs> and then you have the tubercinarium, which is the area between the optic chiasma and the mammillary body. Then moving to the brainstem, it has three components, the midbrain, pons, and medulla. The midbrain cannot be seen, but is represented by the cerebral peduncles, which are two large diverging fur bundles at the midline. You didn't see it actually. Then in the pons, you have your eminentia pyramidalis and the sulcus basilaris. For the medulla oblongata, you have the pyramid and the olivary body. The cerebellum lies dorsal to the brainstem and is separated from the cerebrum by the transverse cerebral fissure. Where a double fold of dura mater called Santorium cerebelli is lodged. This video is brought to you by Group 10. Bravo! Apo, apo, apo! Cast and crew. Thanks, Ed.